intentions are valid But the goal is not to be triggered every time Never mind, it's just life It's okay for my sanity To choose perfect peace And now forever and always be Welcome to another vlog i'm getting ready to actually film a video that's why my hair looks like this sorry the lighting keeps changing i just did my makeup actually i'm looking a little greasy but um i'm grabbing this mirror i'm grabbing an extension cord for my light and then i'm grabbing whew, and then i'm grabbing an additional light I know I give you guys a little montage of me getting ready, but I couldn't show everything, y'all. My camera's about to die. But really quick before I film, whew, got my light. Really quick before I film, I'm gonna put my jewelry on because I'm looking a little plain and bare. So one second. Hey guys, so I'm currently in my closet. You guys saw me in here in my getting ready for Miami vlog. I just want to say it is a mess again it is a mess again but I worked on it yesterday it's getting a little bit better but here I have just my jewelry so I think today let's pick out the jewelry together I'm gonna to wear these I'm gonna pick these earrings these have been my favorite like these ones used to be my favorite. These are from Ana Luisa. These are also from Ana Luisa. I love these though because I can dress them up or down so easily. So we'll put those aside. And then I'm going to grab this necklace. I'm going to grab my Michael Kors watch. This, guys, I don't, I don't set this to the time that it ever is. <gasps> There's me. But <laughs> I wear it. I just wear it. And this bracelet has, oh no. My camera died. I knew it was going to, but anyways, I'm just vlogging on my phone really quick. So I'm going to wear this gold chain. I think it's really beautiful and so simple and elegant, so I think it's perfect. I also am going to grab a ring, this one from Ana Luisa, and I don't know if I want to put on this bracelet, this bangle from Express. I might add it. I might not, but look at this, guys. I got this one as a gift. This is a, a bracelet with my initial on it. I think it's so cute. Also from Ana Luisa, like, I have so much jewelry. And, like, guys, you'll see, like, my Ana Luisa jewelry, I've had th this, I've had these for over a year. And they look amazing. These, I've had for three months. And they're, they're just not high quality, so you see them changing color. I've showed you guys this before, but, like, there's nothing like quality jewelry. Like, you know, this um, pendant here. This one is also from Ana Luisa. It was a gift as well. So, anyways, I love my Ana Luisa pieces. Well, like I said, I'm getting ready to film. That's why you can see my ring light behind me. I really want to upgrade my lights. I think I told y'all that in my one of my Miami vlogs, but I really want to upgrade my lights. But look at this necklace. It's just so beautiful. I need to put on some hand cream. I'm going to use my Parfum de Marley. Delina body cream just to rub on my hands you guys I recently got some of those um oh look they're right here I recently got some of these gloves from Melody Susie but I just got them off Amazon but you put them on your hands for when you do your own like your own gel manicure or you can take them to the nail salon with you and they protect your hands from the UV rays because apparently people's hands are getting old and wrinkly from getting gel manicures and that's crazy like i feel like my hands have actually started to look a little bit more aged and i don't know maybe i just need to drink more water but that's just not okay with me so anyways all right this is my michael kors watch it was a gift but i've never put a battery in it or charged it or done anything with it that's fine <laughs> these are my earrings the earrings i was telling you about i can't wait to do my hair it looks so crazy Y'all, I'm about to put on a wig. Y'all are going to be so shocked. Because y'all are just going to be like, huh, what? I like the backs that Anna Luisa has because they're so um, wide. Like, they're not so small. So, the surface area, like, they just feel so secure in your ears. 
and I have like a stretched earlobe over here that I need to get fixed. Um, I'm actually going to get a laser and get it fixed, but it keeps the earring up without it just sagging down so low. But these earrings are so cute. I absolutely love them. Next is going to be my ring. I like this ring because on this side, oh, my hands, uh, oh, um, on this side of the ring, it has like tiny little jewels. And on this side, it's just flat gold. And I just think that it's super cute. I don't know why my hands look so wrinkly. Like, I feel like I need to drink more water, but I'm not down with that vibe at all. Like, I don't know. Ooh, it's creeping me out. I don't know. I think I just need to drink more water. I just mastered, you guys, this necklace is so freaking cute. Look. So I just started wearing this necklace. I mean, this, this bracelet when Anna Luisa sent it to me. By the way, they are sponsoring this portion of today's video. So thank you to Anna Luisa for being my sponsor today. Ooh. So I just started putting it on myself because usually I'll get Daniel to do it for me. But recently, he hasn't been around when I'm wearing it. So, okay, hold on. I believe in myself. I can do this. Putting on bracelets. It's like, there we go. I got it. You guys, look how cute. I feel like jewelry just makes a whole look look more put together, just super cute. And it just it has a very put together vibe. And that's what I want to give off. It might not be completely true, but that's what I want to give off. So again, the makeup and this, this rock thanks to my man. So I'm currently in my filming setup. I'm kind of completing the setup now, but like I said, if you guys want to shop any of these pieces from Anna Luisa, I will leave all the links in the description box as well as a general link to their site where you can shop. Guys, you won't regret it. I'm telling you, if you want quality jewelry, if you don't want your stuff turning colors, making your earlobes and your fingers turn green, Anna Luisa pieces are not gonna do any of that to you. I would never steer y'all wrong. And I have been loving these pieces and I have made a wish list. I've been getting these, uh, I've been getting Ana Luisa pieces as gifts for, uh, one of my friends gave me some for Valentine's Day. I was like, like some really cute pieces like that bee um, bracelet. And my husband's gotten me pieces for Valentine's Day and all of the pieces have lasted. I've made sure to take them off when I get in the shower and when I go to sleep and they have stayed perfectly fine. I've been wearing them for like two to three weeks now. Um, so definitely keep that in mind, but they do have some really nice solid gold pieces that I have my eye on. And I already know, like I'm gonna never take it off if I put it on. Like that's just how I am. So do y'all take y'all's jewelry off or do y'all leave it on? Like, I don't know. But anyways, I'm about to film this video. My hair looks crazy, so I can't wait to sit here and hopefully put this wig on, guys. I'm doing a video where I'm following one of Arnell Armand's tutorials on how to um, apply a wig. And so she does it so flawlessly, like it looks so good every time. I'm not a huge fan of the baby hair, so I'm hoping that I'm gonna be able to install it like natural looking, but this is like my only hope for my hair looking good today because I got to go out. I got to <laughs> I gotta go to work. I got to have service church tonight. I got to pick up the kids. So I need to be looking halfway decent. So I don't know. We're going to get it together. I'm going to show y'all after and all that good stuff. But for now, guys, I need to hurry up and get this done. I need to finish setting up my setup. And I need to be doing this laundry is what I need to be doing. But we're not going to talk about that. We still not going to talk about it. <laughs> Hey guys, so I'm back from church. I tried to get some clips, but I literally, I just always forget. I always get so caught up in like what I'm doing and I forget to get clips, but I'm getting ready to wash my face. As y'all can see, I still have this wig on. Now, <laughs> I did wear a hat to church because I when I when I got home, I just sprayed the um, this wig dealer melting spray and then I put the elastic band on it. And that really helped kind of just lay everything down a little bit better. However, the way that I did the lace and the glue is just not what needs to happen. I almost feel like I want to try. Oh, God. <laughs> Y'all, that was so crazy. I literally have not been getting calls at my house all day, honestly, for the past couple weeks. And I just get a call and it's literally my boss, like the highest boss ever. Um 
this part is also crooked so that's cool but um but yeah i need to perfect what i'm doing with this um i'm about to turn the flat iron back while i fix this piece um i need to perfect what i'm doing i kind of feel like i want to put the wig on with just the free spray and just see how that does and see if it's just just more of a chill environment for me because I don't know I feel like I need more practice before I can do the glue like see up close you can see like from back here it's like wow girl that looks great and I also need to like braid my hair down probably and properly because the hump that I get here it's not it's not my favorite especially when the wig is straight so I just need to definitely do better with that as well but I am going to try to sleep in it and see like what the vibes are with that. My husband said that he likes it better straight than curled. Did y'all see it straight? I don't know. If y'all saw my other video, then what do you think? Straight or curly? But honestly, like it just doesn't look bad. Like I want to call my friend. Yeah. I mean, this just doesn't even look bad. Honestly, it doesn't. It literally doesn't. Like I could wear it like this. And most people probably wouldn't know. But from here, like the side, the hump, that's not cute. Like, that's not cute. Those, that bulky braids. That lay down would be amazing. But I feel like the hat really helped lay it down, but it kind of like pushed all this up. So I'm trying to make sure that all that lays down. I'm going to call my friend and I'm going to tell you what she says. And then I'm going to come back and get unready because my makeup is starting to look crazy. I'm actually just gonna cut a little bit like around my face. I just feel like I need some relief. It's just too bulky and heavy. Just like, you know, some face framing layers a little bit. I feel like it will look more natural. I am enough as I can. I am fully equipped. Even when the tide and the current start to shake, I am adaptable. I am hey guys, I'm in the car with Z and George. I just picked them up from school. Say hey. We have a perfect day. We have a perfect leg day. A perfect leg day. Hey, they got in the car down. and George was like, we had the most perfect day ever. And then Zara said, I had a perfect day too. I'm like, that's what I love to hear. You know what I mean? Paying for the education. They better come home talking about a perfect day. That's what I'm talking about. But yeah, I just picked them up from school. It's Wednesday, so we have service tonight. Y'all notice anything different about my hair? Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Just something that a little different. beautiful. Thank you. I know. It looks more than beautiful. Oh, I'm gonna Z. make it 1,000% beautiful. Oh, thank you, pretty I'm, girl. I'm gonna call you the wolf of the city, mommy. I'm gonna no. I wanna. I wanted to be affiliate. I made my own number. That is sounds affiliate percent. That sounds like a pretty big number. It is. But yeah. It comes after um a zillion. It comes after a zillion. I'm tired. But anyways, guys, we're going to go grab something quick to eat. We're going to grab... I wish it could be healthy, but it's probably not going to be healthy. And we're going to take it to the church. And um, I'm going to get some work done. And we're going to have service tonight. Um, and that's what we're going to do. Yeah! Y'all ready for that? I'll see you oh, guys later. Mommy, we can't go to Old McDonald's. She won't sit there. She said we can't go there? Yeah, no. She said it's not healthy. That's all. It's not healthy. It's not healthy at all. They have junk food. I don't know anything healthy that's going to be on the way to where we're going. So we might just have to deal with it. Yeah. But, um. Look, look but yeah, good. you guys. This unit is from Hair VV. And I have a video. <laughs> all about yeah, this. George, you so I have to show it. you guys. Here's a ball. Oh, Alright, how about this? This one? I have hot hair. Okay. Don't so, stretch it too much. All the hairs keep sticking down to the lace, but this and is how it looks. Here, but the, and, and Otherwise, um, I did have some technical 
difficulties I give it. with the insulin of the bald cap. And I really didn't do it right, but it still looks good it. anyways. I, I but I'm just wearing a hat because I feel most comfortable. Until I perfect the technique, I feel most comfortable with the hat. That's where did my hat go? But yeah. So I'm just rocking the hat because you know. Can I try? I didn't have time to like really so perfect it, perfect it. This. Um, but I plan on it. So, all right, guys, we'll see you when we get to the church. The balance between problem solving and the universe working itself out. All that I have is all that I need. But to actualize it, I came down. No doubt. Good morning, guys. It is Sunday morning. I'm literally rushing around per usual. Um, it's Palm Sunday and my daughter is dancing. I know I did an absolutely terrible job. Terrible, terrible, terrible job of updating you guys along this weekend. Honestly, like I was just going with the flow of my life and, um, yeah, I'm sorry. Honestly, my memory card was full and I didn't have time to dump it. Elegantly Tokyo from Zara. Y'all, it's so good. This whole line of fragrances, um, from what I've smelled so far, they smell good. Next time I go back to Zara, I definitely want to sm smell and buy some more. Anyways, guys, I'm trying to be quick because I'm just going to do my makeup at the church at this point. That's what I'm going to do. Um, because I really don't have the time, but I do want to grab my jewelry and put my jewelry on before I leave. Okay. We're going to pretty much do the exact same jewelry that I did the other day. Um, I need to fix my settings on my camera because something's not right about it. Like when I import my footage, I just don't have time to fix it right now. So this footage is also probably going to look the same. But it's like when I move, it's like it's not the right frame rate at all. Like I can tell. But I don't have time to figure it out right now. So I'm doing the same except I'm wearing both of these. Um necklaces from Ana Luisa, the B pendant. So that's what it looks like. Super cute, right? Super cute. Skedaddle. We actually um, need to be leaving right now. We're about to leave. Thank you. How did you know I needed three more? I don't know. <laughs> Hey guys, we gotta go. super simple but they were so cute and they did a good job no it's because they forgot to do the motions you guys forgot to do the motions yeah. who forgot everybody okay. you guys didn't do any motions but you guys did a great job preparing the way for the lord amen and um we're getting ready to head to family dinner and we're gonna go hang out with coco coco, coco is um my mother-in-law's dog she's a shizu however you say that so yeah um daniel actually just went to meet my dad and my brother at the racetrack and they're doing nascar vibes all that stuff today we are not doing that so me and zara are gonna have a good old time i do have some straightening up and clean to do at the house but we're gonna try to paint the nails right zz and just do cute girly stuff because that's what we want to do right uh-huh all right so we're about to be on our way there i just wanted to give y'all an update 
because as I said before, I didn't do a very good job of vlogging this weekend. But when I tell you guys, the event that I spoke at at Friday, it was so good. My sister Charity was the other speaker. And the whole thing was just fire. The whole thing was just fire, fire, fire. It was so good. It was such a privilege and an honor to even, like, be doing that. And, like, for me to have basically two speaking engagements in the same week like that, like, I just really felt used by the Lord okay that's all I can say and it just it feels good to be walking in 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 my purpose you know it just it feels good so anyways guys off I go to dinner I am so hungry Zara are you hungry yeah yeah so we're gonna kind of well Zara had breakfast and I did not so we're gonna head that way we're probably gonna be the last ones there um, but I'll see y'all a little later. So it's Monday. I don't have long to do this because my camera's about to die, but I'm sitting here. I'm sat here with the suitcase, as they would say in the UK. A brand new suitcase because I'm going on a trip tomorrow. So tomorrow I'm flying to Ohio, my hometown, to handle some family business. And I'm coming right back around the next day and I'll be home on Wednesday. So it's not a very long trip. It's quick. So I just wanted like a small carry-on bag. This one is by the brand, uh, I don't know if you can see that, but it's by the brand Cowpack. And I got it at TJ Maxx. Um, note though, guys, they had two of these. And one of them was marked for $99.99. And I just happened to pull the other one that was just like it down to see which one looked like newer. Um, because, you know, their suitcases don't come like pre-wrapped. So, and I pulled this one down and the tag said $79.99 instead of $99.99. So I actually did end up telling them um, at the store, letting them know like, hey, the, the other one's mismarked. And they actually brought it back around and re-tagged it, which I thought was really thoughtful because they didn't have to do that. Like somebody else could have just bought it for $100 and that would have just been that. But I'm going to go ahead and put my laundry away. I have a lot of clean laundry to put away. I'm going to let my camera charge. And then y'all, tomorrow we're going to Ohio. Period. <laughs> I'm a little like, oh, because it's like there's so much stuff happening and so much to be done. And it's like I'm literally pausing my whole life just to like go there and come back. But and I'm already traveling next week as well. So it's just a lot going on. Um, but all is well. We got to do what we got to do. So, yeah, guys, I will update you guys a little bit later once um I've got my laundry put away and my camera is charged and then I'll kind of update you guys on the weekend because I never really like gave y'all the full rundown of what happened this weekend how amazing this weekend was and everything it was just so good but um I know yesterday I said I would update y'all and then I don't know I just started cleaning and I fell asleep like yesterday I was like let me get the house straight today I was like let me get work straight I'm just trying to like get a little bit ahead because I know that I'm going to be traveling for two days so anyways guys um yeah we'll we'll be back Hey guys, so I'm at the airport. I already got my seating assignment. I'm like in one of the little stores looking at these books. This one looks really good. Magic words, what to say to get your way. Seems like how to get brand deals. Like, and the creative act, a way of being. That seems really interesting as well. Um, I just got Atomic Habits though on Audible. So I think I'm just gonna listen to that and do some work on the plane. I would love to sleep. But I don't really think that I'm going to have time to do that. So, but I like looking at what new books are out and then I can get them on Audible later because the act of me sitting down and reading a physical book is really probably not going to happen. I don't know why it's so dark in here. Hold on. That's better. I just like my regular settings. I tried to change the settings on my camera and I didn't really like it. But I'm going to, I grabbed a water. I'm just going to grab a snack. I'm literally starving and my stomach hurts so bad but my flight's about to board. I don't want to pick anything that's going to upset my stomach because it already feels kind of weird. Guys, I have no idea what to get, but I need to hurry up. So I'm going to get something. I don't want to eat something with a lot of sugar. Oh, okay. All the snacks are really in the back. I'm just going to get the water. Good. How are you? Um, no, thank you. You too. Thank you. All right, guys, my flight's literally boarding in one minute. So, we gotta go. Oh, shoot, they already started boarding. I gotta go. Bye. Oh, my God, that was, like, the last one to get on here. He just called the last and final boarding call. I'm, like, running. It says it boards at 10.13. It just ended at, the boarding ended at 10.13. What is happening? But... 
it's way better than it being late or delayed, so I'll take it. But I have to, I have to do a quick, quick try. Hurry up and get in here. But I'll have to take this first flight to DC, and DC to Columbus. So talk to y'all later. Y'all, I need them to be so for real. They have the largest compartment ever. They wouldn't let me check my carry-on bag because they said it was too big. They wouldn't let me bring it on board. I had to check it. Y'all, they have the largest compartment I've ever seen for bags. Like, it literally could have fit very easily with lots of extra room. So, now, now I gotta pray for my shoulder, y'all. Like, my bag, my shoulder bag is heavy. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, uh, good morning still. Work more flight like 4402 or service up to Washington Dallas Airport. Mm -hmm. Been trances Going all to different places Different planets Watch your aura pass me by Losing balance What if we run out of time And second chances Empty handed You left the Guys, I made it to Ohio I've actually been here for a while now What time is it? It's 3.45 so I've been here for almost two hours But right now we're at the mall we're getting ready to go in Zara, and I cannot bring you guys with me because I'm not carrying my camera around. I'm just not doing it. <laughs> That's really the reason. <laughs> but um, if I get anything, I'll definitely show you guys what I get later. Um, it's a Tuesday, so they have a service tonight. So we're just going to go up to the church and get ready for service after this. Um, and then tomorrow, we're taking care of business, and then I'm going home. So it's really an in-and-out kind of trip. But Ariana's here. Hey. This is my sister. This is my youngest sister. I have three sisters, for those of you guys who don't know. And this is the baby. But I have a baby brother who's actually, like, the actual baby. But he's, like, a grown man, so it's, like... I'm very much way taller than us. Yeah, he's, like, <laughs> just... You'll see him later. He was actually just in Richmond, where I live. Like, and my, and my dad was there, but I forgot to show you guys because I'm just the best vlogger in the world. And the greatest vloggers forget to show things. So, if you didn't know, now you know. Oh, baby, I was It's been such a long day. I wanted to update you guys. It's clear. It's um. It's clearly. It's currently 1:25 a.m. and um, I'm at my parents' house. Um, like I told you guys, like we had service tonight. So after we left the mall, um, we went in Zara, and then we went in this Amazon store. It's like Amazon fashion. It was really cool. Like. <sighs> Sorry, y'all, my brain is, like, a little fried. <laughs> it was, like, they had, like, singles of, like, several items. Like, like one of, like, every item. And then you could grab the item and, like, um, ask for a size. And they would bring it out to you. Go to the fitting room or you could go check out. But it was kind of cool. Um, I, like, literally couldn't leave that store until I found something that I had bought off Amazon myself in that store. And then my sister pointed out this JW pay bag that I have. And I was like, oh my God, yes, I have this. Okay, great. Like, I don't know. I just felt fulfilled by knowing like, I got this off Amazon, but I, it's like in the Amazon store. I don't know. Um, we went H&M. I didn't buy anything in there. Um, I did get two suits from Zara. So like, uh, I'll have to show those to you guys. I'm so tired. Oh. And then we raced to church. And then, like I said, we had some family business to handle. So we were kind of, like, handling family business, like, um, after. And we were just there so late talking as a family and, like, all this stuff. So um, it was all really, really good, though. Um, and tomorrow, like, we pick back up in the morning around um, 9.30. And so um, we're heading back to the other side of town in the morning. Um, and then maybe we'll grab some lunch before I have to catch my flight that's at 3. My flight that's at like 3 p.m. So that's pretty much it. Like such a quick trip. Um, it's been nice. It feels so short. It feels so weird knowing like tomorrow I'm leaving. But yeah, so that's pretty much the gist of it. Then we came back home. And of course I... Oh, not me zooming in. What in the world? Zoom it back out. Okay. Um, hold on. I'm just going to put the camera down for a second. <laughs> I can't even talk to y'all right now. But it was so nice seeing um, everyone at church tonight. Um, just really cool to be able to sneak in and sneak out pretty much. I'm using these Birdspeeds micellar wipes. 
So when I went to um, speak at ODU, which is Old Dominion University, I think it stands for. If I'm wrong about that, that's going to be embarrassing. But I'll look it up before I put this in the vlog. But I went to speak at ODU for the Good Girls Tour. They were having like a week long of events. And so um, a girl that um, was in our youth group, like she goes to college there and she's just... Um, on like the board or like the leadership team for that organization and so um they asked me to come and speak and it was just really really good the girls were really receptive and they were just saying that like it's really what they needed to hear and it was so encouraging for me as well because that was my first time like speaking to college students like not to college students but you know what I mean like on a college campus and everything and like you know I had to be transparent I was like Y'all, like, where I am at in my life, like, I told them, like, you know, why and how I got to where I am just by, like, being faithful to God and, like, following his steps and all of that. But also, like, I was like, I didn't even go to college. Like, I didn't even go to college and I'm speaking at a college. That's kind of cool. <laughs> Put down the negative ideas and the negative um, strongholds that society puts on us, that the system puts on us. We don't have to we don't have to conform to that we don't have to conform to just because we're black this is how far we can go or it's going to be harder just because you're black that's not true it doesn't have to be harder for you just because you're black but if you think that it will be it absolutely will be and so sometimes it does take a little bit of what may seem like delusion in order to push through the boundaries that are So I thought that was pretty cool. Um, and then um, and then I just had like a week of like a lot of stuff going on at work. And then Friday night I spoke at Wow Encounter, which is the women's like the women's services. It's almost like a, like a mini women's conference. And so me and my sister Charity, my, my husband's sister, we both spoke at that. And like it was just so powerful. Like the word that was brought forth from Charity was really awesome. And whenever we reject the assignment in any way, we forfeit our authority. Are you living holy? Are you submitting to your husband? That's a hard one, I know. Are you walking in love with your children even when they're getting on your last nerve? It happens. Are you living by the book? Are you following the assignment? Like, whenever I get, a, like, the opportunity and, like, the privilege and honor of, like, walking in my gift, it's just, it's very fulfilling. But, like, not only is it fulfilling, like, it just, like, it just makes me feel like I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not just, like, sitting on the gifts that God has given me. Like, I'm actually, like, putting them into... Like, I'm doing with my gift what I'm supposed to be doing with it. You know what I'm saying? And, like, and like the testimonies of people who it's helped, it's just all so encouraging. And that's, like, really the reason for it all is just, like, to be able to help people. And so I just absolutely love um, hearing the stories of people's lives being changed for the better. Like, I'm using this Globe Recipe Toner to see if I can try to like get a little bit more makeup off my face. I don't want to put like my um, skincare like serums and stuff on top when I know I probably still have makeup on my face. But I used two makeup wipes. But I'm like there's probably still going to be makeup. It's like hard to get it all off. Just yeah like look without washing your face. But this is what I get because I'm like... <laughs> I don't like sleeping in makeup because I feel like it definitely does me more harm than good when I do that. But we're just going to keep it right there. Oh, yeah. And then I also went to Target because um, Target, I needed like some hair products. So I went and bought, let me show you what I got because this is like one of my favorite. Mine's empty at home anyways, but the Crazy Sexy Curl by The Do is so good. Like this mousse is really good. I also like the Mayel mousse. Um, a lot and then I also grabbed some Kiss Colors and Care Edge Fixer because this is the only edge control that I can use that I like to use for my hair that works every time and this one is in the watermelon scent this one is in the watermelon scent it smells good it just smells like watermelon candy like it smells like my childhood 
But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Um, I'm getting ready to hit the hay and get some rest. Um, but I'll try to pick up with you guys tomorrow. Um, but I know it's going to be kind of like fast paced because I am leaving. And so we're just trying to fit a lot in into like a shorter amount of time. Um, but yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. I love y'all and good night. Then, six days before the guys we're at Starbucks hey it's a new beautiful day in the city of Columbus and we just ordered a whole lot of stuff so I don't know where we're gonna put it Mercy said no. what's crazy is this industrial mace Police yeah this is like police grade mace oh yeah but this is like a, a flashlight a whistle a compass this is like a, a blade that can like cut someone. And then it also has a tactical pin in it, but I keep it over here because Uncle Larry's always like, where's that tactical pin? So it's a real pin, but this can literally shatter your mirror, your window if you hit it. It's so weird because it just doesn't seem like it would do any, it is sharp though, like if you touch it. Yeah. But like, he was like, don't even, don't even try to like, just don't even try to like be curious about it because it will shatter your window. And I was like, are you serious? He's like, yes. And then, and then they gave us that mace. Why does her matcha latte look like this? It's matcha lemonade. Oh, oh. Not to be like annoying or like complaining, but like she literally handed us a drink with the lid just resting on the top of it. <laughs> like, sorry, the lid's falling off and it's completely full, but if you would just <laughs> take it to your destination, you should be fine. Ma'am, it's gonna be all over the cot. It's gonna be all over the cot. I was gonna ask her if she could just pour it into a venti cup. That was gonna be my next thing. Mm -hmm. But it looked like she kind of got it on there. I think it's on there. Yeah. We are back at Zupa. Me and Ariana actually ate here yesterday. Zupa's? It's my sister, Rayma. <laughs> my mom. Say hi, Dr. Tracy. Hello. This is, can I get it in? It's called Zupa's. It's Dr. Ford. Hey. This is my dad. We're gonna have soup and salad at Zupa's. Zupa's. That's where we do it. It was so good, guys. Um, I don't know if they have this where you are, but I got this red uh, pepper. Some, uh, lobster bisque. It's so good. It was really, really good. I don't. I'm gonna get that today, but I don't know what sandwich I'm gonna get. I got the ultimate grilled cheese last time. It was good, but I think I want to try something a little more, more feisty today. Beth, my daughter Beth is the Beth Beth ever. <laughs> the Beth method. My dad has all the puns, but anyways, guys, I'll show you what the place looks like. Aren't you the nicest? David, you made it! I need to change my settings. I do, is that too dirty? Oh, I gotta leave in like 15, 20 minutes. Dave, I can't even get us both in here. This is my brother, Dave. What it do? He's my little brother, but look at him. Jeez Louise. And he was, him and my dad were literally in my hometown this weekend when I was supposed to be vlogging, but I did so bad. And this is my sister, Joelle. Pop locking and dropping. <laughs> this is my whole family, y'all, literally in one place. Can you believe it? such a blessing except for the little ones the teeny boppers aren't here but you know we miss them gotta have a break right exactly we do gotta have a break <laughs> exactly oh it's so good but it it has nuts on it though man i'm so salty i can't cry these desserts look so good chocolate mousse Strawberries and cream, creme brulee, salted caramel creme brulee. What did you get, Beth? I got the roasted red pepper lobster bisque and the brisket grilled cheese. Period. It's good. Period. The soup is phenomenal. 
Well, you guys, I am home. Let me clean off my lens. It looks smudgy. That's better. Um, Y'all, I'm so tired. I went to the church when I got, when after I landed, I took an Uber to the church. I ended up talking to the Uber driver, like the whole 30 minute drive, just about God and like prayer and just all kinds of stuff. It was really cool. And then, um, what did I do after that? I went to the church, hung out for a bit, and then we came home. I ordered, I well, I hung out with the kids a little bit, put them to bed. Um, I ordered some Burger King. Not great, but I really wanted a burger, which it was cold, so it wasn't that great, you know, because DoorDash. <laughs> and then, um, but everything else was closed, and so I just had to get that. And then chatted with Daniel for a while. I talked to my brother on FaceTime, and I'm so tired, y'all. I mean, I look it. Like, it's just very much giving, Where, where where's your sleep? Go get it. <laughs> but I have a Amazon package, and I was like, I really wanted to open it. So, what I got from Amazon is I got two different types of soap. I know it sounds crazy. This soap um, is for my body. This is um, by the brand Microdermabrasion by Everclear Now, 7 Degrees. I don't know. It looks like this. I will link it. Um, as well as this one, Revital Salicylic Acid Scrub Soap. So, this one is for the face. Um... And it's supposed to be really good skin exfoliating, anti-blemish, resurface pore exfoliating soap. And this one, this, um, the Microdermabrasion Soap Bar would deeply detox and exfoliate your skin while promoting new collagen production for younger, tighter skin. That's what I bought as well, is this by, um, Core RX. This is the Advanced Snail 96 Mucin power essence and I'll just I think I already showed what it looked like I think I just never talked about it but it's like a really sticky sort of snail essence I don't know but it's supposed to be really good for the skin for texture people were saying that this gave them glass skin and they were just saying that like it keeps it um, moist smooth and healthy Guys, Zara, say hi. Hi. Georgie, say hi. Hi. So it is Saturday. It's hair day. Tomorrow is Resurrection Sunday. And so George got a haircut. George, turn around so we can see it. Not the top. We didn't cut the top, the sides and the back. Okay, well, he's backlit, so it's hard to see. But now we're getting ready to do Zara's hair. It's been in this blow-dried braid. Um for a while you guys saw when I used the rev air on her we didn't have time to do like a full shebang hairstyle so we just did something quick and then now we're gonna go ahead and braid up the rest of her hair I just want to let y'all know because um, I'm gonna end this vlog in the morning when I show you guys what I'm wearing to church what we're all wearing to church for Resurrection Sunday um, we don't only go to church on Resurrection Sunday but we are not those we go to church every Sunday as y'all know but um, we're gonna be looking a little extra fresh, a little extra clean, a little extra something, something. Um, not really. I feel like, kind of, sort of. But Zara has a beautiful dress. She was shopping with her G-Mall yesterday. Did you have funsy? Uh-huh. How many dresses did you get? Four, and one's a bonus. Oh, four? I mean, three, and one's a bonus. Three, and, and one's And that makes four. Are you sure it's four? I think you got three dresses. What? Two, and one's a bonus. <laughs> Anyways, so she went shopping with her G-Mall, got some new shoes, got some dre a dress, I mean a few dresses, really, really cute. I thought that was just like the most adorable thing ever. But yeah, you guys, I'm getting ready to braid up her hair, and uh, I'll show you guys when it's done. We gotta braid it and beat it, y'all, so pray for me. It's about, it's almost 6 o'clock, so I'm hoping to get this done by like 8.30, so I'm gonna be like trying to whiz through it, so yeah. All right, guys, so I don't even know what time it is. It's 11.17. We finally finished the braids. We stopped so many times, though. Something is happening on my head. I love you. Look at my bald head. You're not bald. I'm bald head. Okay. Anyways, let me show you. Zara, stand still. So we got all the braids in. So we're going to have to add the beads later. But you, you can see. Tomorrow? 
Yep, but you can see how long her braids come. Super long. And what I added to her hair is just the Simplicity hair oil, the show oil. This is the kids one. If it will focus. And then I also use the leave-in conditioner just on like the mid lengths and the ends just to add some moisture to her hair while it's in this protective style so it doesn't dry out. Like I said, we'll have to add the beads later and I will show you guys the entire finished look tomorrow or something. But is this just from wearing the hat or do I have a giant pimple coming? Please don't be a pimple. I think it's just from the hat. <sighs> All right, guys, I gotta go. Your heart, keep it in your pocket for safekeeping. Don't ever let nobody be the reason you throw it out. You stop caring about. So this is the end of this vlog. I'm outside at my in-laws' house, and um, it's Resurrection Sunday. So if y'all want to see my get ready with me, I posted it on TikTok. But I just wanted to remind you guys that all of the pieces that I showed you guys earlier in this video from Ana Luisa, all the jewelry pieces, I'm telling you guys, if you guys want jewelry that will last you a long, long time, like these earrings. I've had these earrings since um, over a year ago and they're still perfect. And guess what? They also do, they just have a new policy. I think it's a two year, like no tarnish like warranty on anything that you buy so if anything tarnishes or anything like that then it's basically insured by Ana Luisa they're doing that because they know they can guarantee the quality of their of their product that they're putting out so I will leave the link for Ana Luisa down below don't forget to shop you guys don't forget Mother's Day is coming up this is the perfect thing to ask for for Mother's Day this is the perfect thing to get your mom for Mother's Day so yeah you guys but we're just here um, enjoying family time I'm getting ready to change I was like let me go ahead and get these shots so that I can get a little more comfortable I'm literally keeping this top on and I'm just putting on these um, pink pants that I have I don't know maybe I'll show you guys but if I don't see you guys again in this video I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next one bye don't let your head get in the